All right, what's up guys? We're back with another one. It feels like I just recorded the last one, you know? They're putting out these these trailers way too fast in my opinion. But anyway, we got a new Melty Blood type Lumina trailer. Today is the cooler sister, the older sister, which is she the older one? Is she the older one? I don't know, but it, it, we got Kohaku now, you know, the other maid. Another clone character, not too popular, you know, you guys can say what you want. I know people don't like it when I say that maybe the maids aren't the coolest characters but hey you don't have to believe me look at these views man what's going on with the melty blood character views man they've been plummeting from the start i'm joking of course it's you know it's not a an end-all be-all but the numbers are definitely dropping look at his suey god damn uh, i think it could also be credited to like i said at the start what's going on they're just throwing out these trailers randomly right i wish they gave a little bit more notice like snk i think snk is doing a good job they say, you know, next Thursday, 3 p.m., here's the character trail. Look forward to it. So it gives you something to, to get ready for instead of just kind of dumping it out there. But yeah, anyway. Oh, by the way, you guys let me know in the last video. You let me know, Hisui fans. Shout out to 72. Hisui fans who did not like what I had to say. Before we watch the uh, Kwaku trail, though, let me just tell you. Thumbs down. Don't do anything. They helped me out just as much as a thumbs up. You guys fell for the trap. You fell for the clickbait trap. So got you. But anyway, let's check it out. The cooler sister today. Before we watch the trailer, you know, so when I was saying I didn't really like her because she's kind of like turtly, you know, a bit slower, a bit more plain. Kohaku is the opposite, right? She's very, very tricky. She's a lot of setups. Very, very offensive once you get started. You know, command grab, mix ups, all sorts of stuff. Oki tools. So a lot more exciting, uh, in my opinion. So let, let's see her in action here in the trailer. I need to hear. I need to hear the music too. <laughs> I always, you know, because I do the trailers and I'm talking. I need to just go back and listen to all the songs. Or I guess I'll just wait till the game comes out next time. But here we go. She has a lot of different plants, right? There's a fire plant. Right off the bat, you see a nice mix-up. ka -ching! Dropping the earth. Grabbing a different plant. And it's an overhead. As you see, very, very offensive, right? Very aggressive. And that's Johnny. That's Hey Johnny, come on. Clash Molotov. They love the clashes, man, every time. And then ends in the arc drive. Now, that used to do a circuit break. They used to, like, seal out your meter, right? At least the powered up one does, but not in this one. Is it just me or are these trailers getting shorter? I don't know. Maybe because I'm watching them all, but it feels like I, they don't really show anything anymore. I don't know. I could just be making it up. But all right, anyway, let's break it down here. So, yeah, as you see, she, uh, being a maid like Isui, she fights with her broom as well as plants, right? That, that's her, her little gimmick right there. She has a lot of different plants. They, there's Even there's, like, a poison plant they don't show, but... You, you see a good chunk of them here. All right. They all have different functions right here, right? So the pine tree is anti-air, kind of locks them down. Gives it time to set the fire plant. I think this shoots out, what, four? Four, five, or six? But watch this little mix-up she gets off this, right? So air to air, locks them down. Now you have to block the plant. Now you're, you, you're stuck here, and she's allowed to move. I love that. That's Melty Blood, man. Delay air dash, right? That is the Melty Blood. Delay, delay air dash or delay... Air backdash. That is like the go to melty mix up. You, you see it all the time. So, already, if you plan on playing Type Lumina, get that in your head. That's going to be one of your, your big mix up options there. And the bat, and then she dropped the, the earth. I don't know. I don't know the deep lore when you guys can light me. I guess she keeps the earth in her apron. Amazing. Run up tree. Now, the tree kind of locks him down. And it, again, it lets her move around so she can run up and do like an empty jump low, that late air dash. But instead, Instant, right away, right? They took that out, I thought, but I guess they added it back in. But yes, that's her jump C. A bit slow, not as fast as some other games, but yeah, instant overhead. And there's Johnny the Cactus, her best friend. Johnny loops for 100 meter. And then, yeah, just the ender on the super ender right there. But damn it, yeah, am I... I gotta go, I'm gonna go back and watch the old ones. I feel like they're getting shorter. You know, take your time. French bread, I know you're a small team, but take your time. Put out, I'd, I'd, I'd rather have less trailers, you know. I don't need three trailers a week. Give me one trailer a week, but make it a little bit longer. A little bit longer. Show a little bit more, and, and I'd be into that. You know, I gave you a little explanation, but like I, I've been doing now, I think it's a good. I think I think I think it's a good idea, man. I think I'm working hard. But let's watch some old footage. You know, this is I think very very helpful, especially for a game like Melty, where the old characters are very very you know recreated in the new one here. So let me get the old tunes going here. 360p, you know, pretty good quality, and let's get it. Well, we should. Oh, I forgot. I wanted, to, I wanted to mention that too. I don't think we saw it in the uh, Type Lumina trailer, but she has. She does have a command grab, and look what she does, right? So she does her little combo, you know, Melty Blood classic right here. Now she gets the Oki. Ready? 
Watch this. So right where I paused it, that's very far away. This is not command grab range. That is too far to land a command grab in any fighting game. Nope, just scoop, just scoop right away. Now, correct me if I am wrong, but I remember back when I played, you know, because I used to fight Lord Knight's uh, Age Kohaku, she had a Kara command grab. So if you don't know what a Kara is, Kara is, the idea is that you cancel out the startup of your move into the special. So for example, if I have a move where I reach forward and, and punch you, or I guess I want to punch, as I'm reaching forward, I cancel that into command grab. So the command grab is now starting from from like, you know, the forward momentum. So you extend the range like that. That has to be car grab, right? That That's super far away for, for a command grab. So it, I wonder if that's gonna carry it over in Type Lumina, we shall see. I'm pretty sure in the main trail they showed the command grab, but I don't think we saw it in that one. But yeah, the follow-up is the bat. H, H is get a full combo, it's crazy. But here we go, this is the round I wanted to show. So some things you need to point out right off the bat, her air dash is almost full screen when she gets on the broom, right? And her ground is a run. So some characters in the game have a dash, you know, that means that it covers a short distance and stops. She's a run, so she can run as long as she wants to. So she can get in, you know, she's a good mid-range character with her broom, but when she wants to get in your face, she can approach real easy. Watch, watch his air dash, ready? Whee! See how far that went? And then he had jump C. Was that two C? So like her B and C normal, where she uses the broom, really, really good mid-range. And then she has this a lot too. So she has a lot of moves, I think I mentioned it, I don't know if I did, but she has a lot of moves that force a hard knockdown. So in Melty Blood, you can tech, right? You can tech forward, back, and stuff like that. But a move that charges or forces a hard knockdown leaves you there on the ground and allows her to start setting these plans, right? So, right? It's not about the damage, right? She's just doing this. EX slice to get the hard knockdown, and now you set up Johnny. Now she can go high, low. What you gonna do? There's that's what I said earlier, right? That's the melty blood. Air dash back. Right? So from here, from this position, right, she can air dash forward, she can air dash back, she can just come down straight with like a jump C, jump B. She can land and go low. Air dash back, right? And again, just loop right back into itself. There's a lot of damage too. 5k melt is a lot. And again, loop, Johnny, the mix. Charge, empty jump low, charge, empty jump low again. Although not real, I don't get really low. Are they? Let me know in the comments. Is her 2A a low? There's the X Molotov. See, the X Molotov where she drops all the bombs. Mad annoying because you block them and she's plus a million. Then you interrupt her. Like you saw CL or Powered CL went for the air grab. Interrupted, still got hit by the Molotov. But that's cool, you know, Melty, Melty. The meter, meter is valuable. Like 100 meter specials are strong. So that's how it should be, right? You don't want to have worthless moves in your game. Now PCL doing a little combo, but we're not here to see that, right? We're just see Kohaku. PCL, I'm sorry. Even though Obama loves you, you're not going to be added in the game, I don't think. So she's activating heat now. We're getting some health back. Put out a plant. Again, there's that long air dash I talked about, right? Covered the full screen they just got in with Punish of Lightning, and now a little Kohaku corner combos. Dropped it early in the hard knock, and I set down the plant. We've seen that, what, three times, four times already in one round? Tried to go for the instant overhead, but a little bit too early. Right? If, if that hit, that was the round. <laughs> Johnny again, and you see how PCL had to avoid the cactus. Because even if you hit Kohaku, the cactus stays out. And it, it'll interrupt you, so you just have to avoid it. Same with the, like the fire plant. Even if she's wide open, you can't take a swing. You gotta escape. And look at this ender. Very, very unlucky though. Powered sail is, is a bit too turnt. Shooting lightning the complete wrong way. Damn, that sucked. And then easy, easy finish there. But yeah, there you go. So that that's a little Kohaku breakdown. As you see, what I what I was saying, you know, compared to Hisui, she's a lot more offense orientated. Her damage is big. I, I was surprised. You know, five a five K combo Melty is a good a good chunk of damage. So she does a lot of damage. She has loops, right? So not combo loops, but Oki loops, right? Drop the Oki. Go for a mix-up. If it hits, you get a chunk of damage, and then you put them right back in the same position for another attempt at a mix-up. And you just repeat that until they die or they burst or something like that. She's fast, so, you know, mention that. We talked about her, just her general movement speed. It's not like she's got crazy fast buttons or anything. It's just her general movement speed is really, really good. 
So for a game like Melty that has very big stages and very mobile based game, you know, a character like her is going to come out on top. And it, she was, dude. She was top in every version of Melty. She was top in every version of NBA A. NBA C, she was weak. But NBA A, vanilla, H Glock was busted. That was like best character in the game. She got nerfed, I think, in the later patches, but I think she's still considered quite strong. I, I think, I think. It might just be my, my head cannon. But yeah, so if you're interested in, in an offensive character who's got setups, she's got tools, she's got gimmicks, she's very kind of free form, you know? You can like put out the plants and then decide what you want to do. Uh, if you're interested in that kind of character, pick her. I think, I think she, to me, so far, Kohaku and Akia are the two coolest looking play styles. Does that mean I'm going to pick him? No, I'm not playing a maid or a schoolgirl, man. Come on. I'm starting with Coma, unless he sucks, and then we'll see. But yeah, that, that's my recommendation for you. So yeah, like always, if you're still watching, thank you. Let me know. Leave a comment. Even if you just want to tell me you hate me and Hisui is the best girl, you know, it's fine. Write it up, man. And just make sure you give a thumbs up or thumbs down. It helps out either way. But yeah, if uh, you want to see the other characters too, you'll see them eventually, probably this upcoming week. And then whenever the new characters come out, which has to be soon because the game's coming out in a month and a half or so. Uh, of course, I will be breaking them down here same day, 24 hours, thanks to the panned editors. Now, I, I really hope they put a new character in, though. It's fun looking back at the old characters and seeing how they get brought to Type Lumina, but I want a new character, man. When's a new character? I don't know. But anyway, like always, leave a comment. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.